it's Wednesday. <laughs> that means it's always me Wednesday. And as you can probably tell from the state of my hair today, my ever-changing hair, um, it's chaos. It's chaos here because it is um, the Positively Disruptive Symposium Week and I'm moving house on Friday. And there are storms and weather all over the world that are affecting everyone, um, both in terms of those people directly affected and then the ripple effects that that has on everyone all over the place as well. Hi, if you just joined me. Um, yeah, so for the symposium, uh, what that means is that so far this week we have had two days. We're on our third day today. So on Monday we had Mastering the Masculine and Feminine um, with Eloa and Nige Atkinson. And yesterday we had um, talking about body wisdom with Coral and Natalie. And so, so far on day one, we had internet issues. Um, and Nige and Eloa, their audio was great. And so that's fantastic. For the most part, we kind of hung in. Um, and this is the thing when you do live events, there is often stuff that happens that needs to be navigated. So we had internet issues on Monday. Um, we managed to carry on kind of talking through it and we had some great takeaways. Um, we talked about whether the world is a friendly or an unfriendly place. We talked about um, the assumptions that we make when we're trying to communicate um, in men to women and women to men. Um, we talked quite a lot about understanding the range of emotions that are acceptable and how we can um, diversify the, vi the dialogue and the vocabulary that we have um, for, for the different feelings that we feel and, and, how, that and that, how that might work. Um, so that was really fun. Um, and then we had last night, Natalie, who is currently in France, um, also had internet issues. <laughs> So, um, unfortunately, she was not able to join us live on um, audio or, or, video, or video. And it was um, an, an interesting thing to try and keep that going. But she stayed in the chat. Um, so our, we've saved all of the chat for those of you who have bought the replays. We are going to share that with you as well. So there were lots of great questions being asked in the chat. Um, and I also read out loud quite a lot of what she was saying and what people were asking and so it was really interaction um, led and we followed that through we had some great conversations about um, the different stories and the different journeys that we've been on with uh, learning to trust our bodies learning to accept our bodies learning to listen to our bodies and also um, the idea that the brain or the or the ego or the like uh, the rational part of our brain often wants something different from what the body wants and how we move into a place of surrender and kindness with that. Um, so there were all sorts of takeaways in both days that were really interesting. For me, the key takeaways, again, were that we are all unique and that we are not a one size fits all. And that that's why coaching, uh, as opposed to mentoring, works so well because what we're trying to do when we coach is help uh, you to listen to your own internal wisdom, your own internal guidance system and um, develop a much stronger relationship with yourself, with, the, with that voice that knows so that you can make decisions that are right for you, so that you can feel embodied, so that you've trust yourself, so that you can make choices that are empowering for you. Um, and similarly with the empowering uh, and mastering the masculine and feminine, really paying attention to your own energies, when to um, use your more masculine energy, when to use your more feminine energy, understanding that it's a spectrum and that we're all unique and that we each have cycles. Um, and being kind of, yeah, creating space in our lives so that we can be with each other, so that we can come from a place of love rather than fear, so that we can be open to what the other person has to say or that they might be saying or feeling or thinking. Um, and creating that space in order to be present with one another. So we talked a lot about presence and paying attention. And similarly, in the body wisdom one, we also talked about presence, being present when we eat so that we know whether we're enjoying our food, what it tastes like, what it smells like, the colours involved, so that we know when we're full, so that we know when we're hungry. None of that, we, we can't do any of that if we're not paying attention, if we're not um, 
being present with ourselves. So those were some of the key takes up, takeaways. Tonight I am joined by Layla and Kylie and we're going to be talking about the power of communication and language and storytelling. So again, I've got no idea what will happen. Um, it was, it's always fun and it's really interesting because um, the old me, the like five years ago me, could not have handled this week, could not have handled um, things not going to plan, it being live, answering people's questions off the cuff, not being given a chance to like plan something clever or funny or perfect to say and what I love about this event and why we've created it in the way that we have is that it really is the embodiment of the two um, the two kind of guidelines or guiding principles or the manifesto of the M2M way which is all about community over competition and all about participation over perfection so it's not about any single voice here being um, being an expert but about us all having our own voices about us all just being able to be a part of this and and that we participate and that it's okay for me to run an event and it for it not to be perfect it's okay for me to run an event and someone's internet not work and not me be going oh my god it's my fault it's terrible and so just observing this change um, has been really interesting for me as well. So I'm really excited uh, about the conversations that we have tonight and for the rest of the week. Um, and yeah, uh, for, <laughs> for the moving that's happening and the boxes that are, are um, piling up around me. And you might see me getting nearer and nearer and nearer this backdrop as the week goes on <laughs> so that I can carry on unpacking the things around me. Uh, but I'd love for you to come and join us tonight. If you're not signed up yet, you still can. You can go to IamPositivelyDisrupted.com and sign up. Um, for everyone that is signed up, you will get an email both an hour before and 15 minutes before with your link. Um, and we will be on Demio again this evening on a unique link talking about language and the power of communication and stories tonight um, and then tomorrow we have playfulness and friday we have resilience all being well so thank you so much for it's lovely to see you stella i don't know who else is here because i'm on the app thing it doesn't show me so it's so lovely to have you um, and maybe i'll see you later bye